Liam Griffin's Monarch Spa has been voted the world's second best and probably the only place in Ireland where you'll find a Shaolin monk practising Tai Chi in the afternoon. So he can get us, you yeah, and I, yeah. to look a little bit like him. Yeah, right, yeah. you will, can, but we need operations for it. <laughs> <laughs> and come here, does he? Can you help out with Wexford hurling? <laughs> yeah, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> look at that. Of course, we all know Liam from his days managing the Wexford hurlers to their last All Ireland title in 1996. Wexford are the All Ireland hurling champions. People in Wexford didn't hear of Liam Griffin, but I'll tell you one thing: the whole world knows Liam Griffin now. His experience in sport inspired him to develop Monarch. Well, the one thing that you learn about training after a while is that freshness matters in sport, and rest and relaxation and recovery are actually probably more important than actually training, which seems a little bit daft, but it's not. It's actually true. And simply, people don't do enough of that in business or in life in general. Liam, you've been in the hospitality business for a good few years. Yep. Where did it all start? My first job in a hotel was a kitchen porter in the Ashton Hotel in Parkgate Street for a pound a week. And that's where I started. And, you know, my kids will start saying, no, you're barefoot as well, Dad. No, I wasn't, but I, that was my first job. I wanted to do something in my own area. I come from here, I'm born and bred in this area, and I wanted it to be special, and I wanted it to be something that, you know, we'd all be proud of. And I am, and we are. The great thing about my art is we try to do everything that everybody else wasn't doing. We don't want to be seen as some kind of a an upmarket place that's only for the elite. It certainly is not. We've got everybody coming to this place. Condon Astor, probably the Bible of travel. We've got runner-up in the world uh, in spa retreats worldwide. Now for us, that was a major achievement. There was places that are iconic buildings around the world. But we're from Ireland, we're from Wexford, and we got second in the world. And that is some achievement for our team and for what we try to put here and for the concept we put together. A lot of people think hotels are very kind of sexy places, nice to own a hotel and all that. It's no different than uh, selling muck you know, or shoveling dung. It's just, it's just a business, like. And people get carried away with the hyper statute. I'm in the business to serve people, and that's what all of us are in, and that's what we do. It's not about personalities. It's about what we do as collectively as a team. I think it's just like sport. You have to have a passion for it. And if you don't have the passion, I don't think you can get there. It's the same with an under-10 hurler. If you walk into him and you, you give him a bit of enthusiasm and you give him a bit of praise, he'll bang balls over the bar from all angles. If you put him down, he won't get up. And if the leadership is not there to make you want to get up and do it, why would you bother? Nothing great was ever achieved without enthusiasm, and I'm not going to lose mine. And that's what keeps people like people like me in business.